Sounds out loud enough. To choose one or the other, yeah. I'd never do that. Even in a if you woulda, coulda, coulda, woulda, shoulda role. Oh. with the mysticism that exists here and the way that that exists in nature and I don't believe in God but I love phrases like supernatural that created it. There have been, people have been combining human bodies with animal heads for as long as there's been man and animal and so it's, a, it's an ancient thing that I'm riffing on. Like if you dared to paint another damn Pegasus or you're a 16 year old girl, you know, I, show me a Pegasus I haven't seen before. For, Maybe that would make me feel better about it. But this is just an ancient riff. There was one guy who was real mellow, kind of like your kind hippie uncle. And he'd teach you how to make paintings on Sunday morning on the public channel. And then there was an old German guy, and he was kind of tough. But he could make it a whole painting with one brush. And he would talk about how you could do anything. And you were the almighty creator. It hurts. It is so nice. And I really got tears of joy when I paint like that. I, I can't express it's going to, I talk too much, sure I do talk too much, because I know if you paint this, the only way to fly. And then I say, get yeah, that big brush and fire in with that brush. God, they say, the guy is mad. I say, yeah, you, you ruined your whole life with this little lousy small brushes. Don't do that to yourself. You own it to yourself to be nice. No, I talk big to the... Everything's going my way. on PBS where I'm a slide guitar player and all the filler stuff and they pay me and license it. You know what I'm talking about? Right. I want to be that guy. Ready? Today, this show is brought to you by Wachovia and the charitable trusts of the charitable trusts of uh, It's up to you guys, but then Charlie Rose follows. 